Well, guys, welcome to Mr. Web Reviews. So, this is a question I'm very often asked, and like most things, it's actually very simple once you know how, as you see in a few seconds. I'm going to show you how to display those categories on your shop page and also on any internal pages, including your home page. Right, so let's have a look at how to do it. So this is an e-commerce website, and as you can see, we have a store page, and we have different categories here. So as you can see, this is a clothing store. So let me show you the store at the moment, the store page. So there you go. And as you can see, all you have at the moment is products, simple products, uh, and that's it. So we don't have any categories displayed here on top. And what we want to do, obviously, is add our categories now. So how do we go about that? Very simple. Let me show you. So we go back to our WordPress dashboard, and from here we go into Appearance, and then Customize. So we can, you can see we have a preview here of our install. Then we go into WooCommerce, and we click on Product Catalog. As you can see, our first drop-down menu here is for the shop page display. So this is our shop page as it looks at the moment. But if you click on this drop-down menu here, you can see it has, you can see that among those three different options, you have show products, show categories, and show categories and products. So these are the options that we are interested in. So we're going to select show categories. And just like that, we have our categories now being displayed. And if you select show categories and products, you will first show our categories and then our products. As you can see, if you select this option here, it's not very neat. As you can see, there's a mixture of both uh, categories and products. So what we can do basically is to customize our layout slightly. So we can change things around a little bit. Instead of having four columns, maybe we can have just three of them. So how do we do this? As you can see, shop columns here. You can use the slider tab and then slide it to the left. And then now you have three columns. And now you can see it's nicely evenly distributed. We have our three uh, categories on top followed by our products. So if we were to publish this now and save it, and we go back to our shop page, so this is how it used to look like. And now we have a product categories. Now let's say you don't want to display any products at all, just the categories. So back to the customizer here. And then we select show categories only. And then publish, back to the website, refresh, and there we go. Now, what if you wanted to display those categories on your home page or any other page uh, that you have? All you have to do, let me show you now, what we do is basically is exit out of here, and then we go into our pages. So we're just going to put that on the home page. Uh, as you can see, we are using Elementor uh, page editor here, page builder. So I'm just going to click on this. But now you might be using Gutenberg, Breezy, or Beaver Builder, maybe one of them. But with Elementor, it's the same anyway. So what we do is basically add a new section. And we're going to select a short code. We're going to add a short code section, basically. So what we do is drag and drop this here. And this is the short code we want to include. Bracket, product, underscore, categories, close brackets. And as you can see, now we have our section here. So if we update this. And now if we go back to our home page. And scroll down a little bit. As you can see, our categories are now being displayed straight up there on our home page as well. And back to Elementor here, as you can see, all we have to do is add a short code, and you can do that uh, with any page basically. You know, it doesn't have to be the home page, it could be any internal page if you wanted to add those categories. All you have to do is just click and add a short code to your section, and this is how you display it on any internal pages. Well, there you go, guys. This is how you display your product categories on your pages. I hope you found this helpful. If so, please don't forget to push the button. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you.